So last month, right, I made this video on a game that you may or may not know about. It's called The Division. And in that video, I was like, this game, save your money on it. Because it's going to be super average. You're not going to have much to do in the game. It's going to last you for like a month, yada, yada, yada. I didn't say it was bad, but I just said it was meh. It was ultra meh. And due to a bunch of stupid people that told me to buy this game and that like made me not believe in my own analysis of the game even though I'm always right but they somehow made me doubt myself and I was like you know what maybe I should give this game a chance so I bought the game and I played the game and I have to say I should just listen to myself all the time because I was 100% correct about this game now the game it isn't bad, like I said, it's not bad. It's just not great. And that's what that game was advertised to be. This game was advertised to be great. It was advertised to be the survival shared world shooter. I mean, I said this all in my other video. You can check that video out, like it, like that video, and then come back to this video. Because this video is just gonna be a review of what I played on the Division, the full game, and not the beta that I played before. So, in the full game of The Division, this has to be the most boring grind of any video game that I've ever played before in my life. And I just want to put it out there that I've played many MMORPGs and mini RPGs from Vanity Star to Final Fantasy to Kingdom Hearts to all of these other games that I've played before. Right now I'm playing Black Desert Online. That game is awesome. I highly suggest you buy that game, Black Desert Online. But when it came to The Division, no, it's just super boring. There's nothing special about that game to keep someone there. The only thing, the only reason why people want to play this game is to get the the high level loot at the end of the game. But what do you do once you get the high level loot? It's just basically, it's like you're collecting cards. Like you're collecting baseball cards. Like you have all of these baseball cards, but what are you going to do with them? Nothing absolutely nothing it's the same thing with the division once you get to the end of that game you have a bunch of guns but what do you do with the game what do you do with the guns you don't do anything because uh there is no competitive multiplayer you have the dark zone but the dark zone is so boring there's not really much to do in the dark zone uh you pretty much just run around looking for loot and like you find some people who may try to attack you so you kill them it's not that exciting really i mean they're trying to implement some things to make the dark zone more exciting like they're gonna start dropping random loot crates around the dark zone but i don't know how much that's gonna do for that game really if they really wanted to make the division more interesting than it already is and they'd add competitive multiplayer into that game and start making the PvP more relevant because at this point the game is just super boring and that's all I have to say it's not a bad game it's not a great game as compared to Destiny the only thing that it has over Destiny is story but besides that I'd rather play Destiny I'd rather play Halo 5 than the Division and I don't like 343 and there I don't like Halo 4 Halo 5 whatsoever but I'd rather play Halo 5 and play the Division at this point that's my opinion like the video dislike the video i don't care as long as you write in that comment section why you agree or disagree with me and subscribe to the channel for more of king dubs unpopular opinions and a bunch of other gaming news and maybe some anime news and stuff for the future because i've been watching a lot of good anime that i want to tell you guys about because it's a shame that some of this anime is not more popular peace